to non-league diaries and today it's friday it's friday morning early um, and we've got itv news down here to talk about our winning streak because we're now the only team in europe that haven't dropped a point in the league which is pretty nuts 18 wins from 18 games so we've got um jono coming down um harry cooksey's here tom smith's here face of the brand and uh yeah itv news have, have, have come to to interview the guys about what's been going on and uh, everything about the streak as well as i think a, a news article from the independent has just gone out um kind of shrouded in this kind of jürgen klopp resignation news which has happened in the last hour but um we move and uh hopefully this will be quite an interesting next couple of hours uh, in front of the, the film crew the boys have been used to getting filmed so hopefully they perform for itv news so I've been looking at your YouTube channel, it's really good. Like the videos and stuff on it. Thank you. It's all thanks to, yeah, all yeah. Thanks to that man Mr. right Mr. Bass, there. yeah. It's nice, nice camera as well. He does put a lot of, he gives himself a lot of air time. That's the only thing. <laughs> he do does, you, yeah, videos. he does like to, uh, he likes to get himself in the, in the vlogs as well. <laughs> he tries to. Excellent, excellent. Hi. Hiya, how are you? you right? I'm Carolyn. Hiya. Hi. Uh, Gemma from ITV London. Hiya. 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 You alright? Hello, Thomas. Hi, Doing my dad. Yeah, yeah. Oh, God, it's so what busy. A life. What a recruitment life. Yeah, supposedly. <laughs> Harry picks the team and I'll just follow. That's <laughs> <laughs> how so it works. Excellent. Yeah. Uh, so, what we thought. We can let everyone know that. <laughs> <laughs> Their camera's a lot bigger than mine. The deco was a lot bigger. <laughs> oh, they've done you, Basher. Yeah. They've done you, mate. Way bigger, Bash. <laughs> Not that size. Not about the size, yeah. You keep telling yourself that. I'm going to get you to. Do you mind putting some football boots on, doing some stuff on the pitch? Um, just, just basic I'm, 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 stuff. Yeah, I mean, I haven't got any boots with me. Oh, it doesn't matter then. Does it matter? No. I'm pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, no, what I mean fine. is, do you mind not having football boots? No, that's on? fine, yeah, yeah, that's fine. Yeah. It doesn't matter then. I might have full boots. What, <laughs> well, those Astros? Uh, you got them Astros? Uh, no, no, it's got boots. You, you, you need to do loads of sit ups and press ups, apparently. That's what, that's what you want yeah, that's to what you do. Got to do. <laughs> <laughs> Box to boxes. <laughs> I was saying to Gibber, I called him last night, I said we're doing it. <coughs> and I was, I, was, uh, I was saying, yeah, I'm going to say that we, uh, like the winning runs just because we've got a new scientist in and he sends us all, all out like raw liver to eat day before a game. <laughs> so then we can, that's why we score our goals late in the game. I was like, it's just so weird. Yeah. Yeah. Just liver and, and just raw milk. Yeah. <laughs> he was like, don't do that, I can't put my name on that. <laughs> all right, Gibber. He's done a very tactical, like hiding by hiding the stomach behind the boards. Pot <laughs> belly. <laughs> <laughs> it's very tactical. I like that. He's thought about this. <laughs> the Inter Independence article has just gone out as well. That's the funniest title. That's the funniest title. It's. Played 18, 118. Meet Farnham Town, the club with a perfect record, their own documentary, and the Surrey Zidane. When you tell Cooksley, he's gonna love it. On his Wikipedia, it says he's sometimes referred to as the Surrey Zidane. I think a fan did it like six weeks ago and they put it on his Wikipedia and no one's changed it. And uh, now he's in the national news called the Surrey Zidane. What's this on? You're on the independent. Look. Farnham has attacking spark in midfield. Yeah, I don't know about that. It's backwards and sideways, isn't we, Gaff? That's it, mate. So is this, is this why we're all on the independent and ITV? Because of our unbeat, we're the, the only team yeah, in it's Europe. Yeah, you know, 18, isn't it? <laughs> Loves it, doesn't he? <laughs> Loves it, doesn't he? Yeah. The independent, giving it large. Oh, no. <laughs> I, literally said, I literally said to him, it was put in there, it was bantered by a fan, and he's gone, oh yeah, fair enough, I thought it'd be that. And he's just ignored it, and he's just gone, yeah, f it, I'm gonna use it. <laughs> Meet Farnham Town to cover the perfect record, their own documentary, and the sorry Zidane. <laughs> 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 oh, brother. National oh, news. Oh, dear, oh, dear. Oh, dear. <laughs> Sorry, Zidane. 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 Sorry, Good players have size 9 feet. 
mate. And we're mugged yeah. in all weather. Yeah. None of this stuff. Because you've got to stand up. Mm. It's all about the balance, mate. Yeah. I mean, to be honest, um, we could do it completely differently. It's a, it's a and finally piece, so I could just be in the middle and we could just be walking along the pitch together. I mean, chatting. Yeah, yeah, yeah that'd be good. Moving, yeah. I just want to be moving. Rather than I can score there. a penalty if anyone's interested in that. No, done this many a time. Sorry, what am I doing? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're media trained yeah, now, aren't you? Yeah, yeah, top, and then. That's a wrap with ITV. You'd hopefully seen it last week if you're watching it today, Friday, literally it was a week ago that it happened. Um, really good experience for the boys uh, at the same time as the independent article goes out. Nice bit of publicity. Who knows if we'll be able to keep the streak going, but it will be tomorrow. It's tested against Hawley at home. Let's get over to Saturday. After that quick intro, we're back here at the Memorial Ground against Hawley Town in the league. It's been uh, it's been a it's been a busy 24 hours at Farnham Town with the independent article and ITV News down here and people taking a piss out of Tom Smith. Uh, but it's uh, it's been it's been very 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 good. So hopefully we can continue the run today. It's one of those things where you feel like someone who's trying pushing the media, like we need to get seen, we need to get seen. It feels inevitable that we that we don't do what we need to do today um, when everybody's looking at us. But hopefully the boys can can blank that out, focus on the task in hand, and uh, and make it happen today and make it 19 wins on the spin from the start of the season. That'd be an unbelievable achievement. 50% of the season if we can make it happen today. If not, it won't define our season. I know John would keep saying that, but that is true. But over to the game. Holy um, today, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah, no, look, good to good to get another one off, uh, ticked off. It's been a yeah, long time coming to get a few on the bounce, so it's nice to get some games out of the way now. So. Uh, perfect weather, pitch looks good, ready to go. So, interesting side against Hawley. You know, we've, uh, I expect, you know, without sort of sounding arrogant, I expect us to be on it today. Our league position is slightly lower than what we want to be. Um, we worked really hard in the off season to put a good squad together um, and had a really good start to the season. You know, the last time we met you guys in the league, we were third. We're now 12th, so, you know, things have dropped off a little bit, but we made some new signings this week, so we're hoping to uh, start climbing the table again imminently. Uh, no, listen, it's a game of football, you know, it's 11 players against 11 players, you know, if we go away from what we've coached the players to do for the rest of the season for one game, then you, you know, you're setting yourself up as a recipe for disaster because you're asking players to do things they don't usually do, so, you know, for us it's, it's business as usual um, and obviously we'll try and hopefully make you guys worry about us as, as much as we'll worry about you. We seem very, very down in a week, I think there was a sort of knock-on effect from, uh, from the I'm not quite sure why, because the boys would be super proud of, of what we're doing at the minute. So uh, that one needed to be got out of the way. Uh, lucky we come unscathed, got the three points, and then today I expect us to be back to our usual best today. Didn't think we were bad on uh, Tuesday night. I thought, you know, first half we was good with the ball, but then it just, yeah, sort of just went flat for whatever reason. Um, but today, yeah, weather's, weather's nice today. Um, pitch, is, pitch is looking good. Um, Lids is back, which is going to be a massive boost up there. So I expect us to be on the front foot today. I'm not sure why, Jack. It just felt very, very low. I think, um, obviously, we, we don't want to sit, keep barking on about the cup game because it was extremely disappointing. But that's gone, and I think we were sort of that was lingering, um, the disappointment of that, and a little bit of self-doubt maybe crept in. I'm not quite sure. I need sort of the players can answer, but sort of come in at half time and we felt. Although we were still winning, it felt flat, and then we come in at the end, and all we we sort of got it over the line. And they're sort of the games that you need to do. Sometimes it's not just about the performance; it's about sort of just getting the job done. And uh, it just didn't feel right. So sometimes it's good just to sort of set them down and you know ask them a little bit of their feedback. You know, I don't think enough managers sort of do that. Sometimes it's sort of bark, bark, bark in terms of how poor the display was. But there needs to be a route to it. You need to understand why, how some players are feeling. You might you might need to sort of. Players might need a little rest. Players might need sort of talking to. You know, you need to sort of manage them properly. So it's just a, just an open conversation in terms of, you know, how's everyone feeling? What's their thought process? You know, is there something that we need to sort of look at or change ourselves? But um, yeah, I think it was just gen general sort of disappointment from from the week before. And uh, again, I think that's been put put aside now and uh, and ready to go today. And uh, I expect that, I expect us to be uh, fully at it today. 
Liz comes straight back into the team today. Moody starts um, today instead of Kyle. I thought Kyle was really good um, Tuesday night, but his first start, so maybe a bit heavy on his legs. So um, he gets some more good minutes off the bench. But um, Moody, Moody's deserved his chance. You know, he, he's, he's not let us down. He just needs to find that consistency of his game. And uh, I thought he came off the bench and it was a big impact. And uh, he probably deserves his start today. And, and Rawdy comes in the other day. Uh, I thought when he came on, that's the sort of that's the Rawdy we want to see more often. I think he's got that ability to change games. You know, he can hurt people in these areas we're standing at the minute. And um, yeah, I think we need to see just that little bit more consistency with him with that. And um, and it, I, I'm sure he's sort of cement, want, looking to cement that cement his place in there. Minus the little. Taking around the keeper. It's a minus. <laughs> yeah, unfortunately, listen. He, when you say he does everything right, he's not done everything right because he's obviously not scored. But the sort of build up to him, he, he's got that ability, sort of not even to move his body much, but he's got that sort of slightness where he just he sort of jinks past players with ease. And he's got that in the. You look at some of his goals when he goes through, sort of through one on one with keepers. He's uh, he's got that natural ability to make it look easy, and uh, he done that. And uh, unfortunately, he sort of just hit the uh, hit the outside of the post. But he'd be disappointed with that. But you know, it's good to see him sort of making these. Chances and creating these chances, so that's a positive. Jack Dean was slot in at centre half today. Again, you know he's had a long time out, so we just protect him in our, in centre half position, so we have a bit more energy um, from the flanks. Joe Jackson to go in there right back. Tom will come in and give us the natural balance on the left hand side. And Max misses out today, um, but loads of games, and he's another one. You know he seems to pick up a lot of knocks. So again, protecting him um, like we did with Smithy on Tuesday. Yeah, he had uh, 30 seconds of fame. Yeah. Yeah, it went well, yeah, it's, it's, a, it's a good afternoon, um, interesting, um, but yeah, it's all, all good publicity for the club and uh, more exposure, so um, yeah, it's a good day. Very impressed with the boys and their uh, their interviews yesterday, it was nice to see, yeah, it was, uh, and rightly so, you know, it's, uh, I think when they look back at it once the season's over or they look back at it in the next few years and, and understand that they put eight, they sort of made 18 games on the bounce, it's, it's some achievement. We should be very proud and the boys should be very proud of what they do and rightly so and they're getting, uh, they're getting rewarded with it with a little bit of an ITV interview so they've all done really well so it's good to see. So knock on effect today, I think it would give them, them boys a little lift in terms of I'm hoping that they would have read this and seen this today and, and realised what they're achieving and it's, again it's something to be really proud of and I just think well, that will be on a knock-on effect today in terms of just lifting the party a little bit and uh, and, and getting the job done today. Yeah, and it helps that they all love each other. And they do love <laughs> I'm, <laughs> I'm, I'm never going to let Smithy down with that. I mean, what he was even thinking about, mate. But it was very nice. We love you too, Smithy. Independent, Independent yeah. And then uh, ITV. And then, um, yeah, yeah, it was a good night last night. A lot of messages and, and whatnot. And, uh, yeah, I think Tom Smith stole the show. You know what I mean? Letting into our secret of how much we all love each other. But, um, you know, it's something I suppose most teams are going to latch on to now about loving each other. So, um, yeah, hopefully we can uh, have a good performance and show the love that we've got for each other. You now, everyone loves each other um, it was without being, you know, in a weird way. It's, it's, it feels like such a, such a good family, you know, on and off the pitch. Everyone's got that togetherness. So I think that definitely helps and reflects, you know, the, the performances on the pitch as well. So. Yeah. Yeah. Absolutely. We're nervous. Well, 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 we love each other. <laughs> 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 weird way. Not in a weird way. <laughs> sometimes we cuddle in the showers. Sometimes we can't get the words out. I just thought we love each other. You're lucky you're here today. At least you're really good rolling that ball. Ball of ours. Characters like, what am I doing? Yeah. <laughs> At this point, you haven't kept your boots clean, though. Oh, mate, I've just been kept away. <laughs> just waiting until the day you come back. Yeah, absolutely kept. Hello, Hello. Hello. How are you? Yeah, very well. Should thank be you. fine, really. Hello, Hello H. Good. Are you? Yeah, you good, mate, yourself? Yeah, good. Should be a fine. Have you seen this? Seen his boots? Seen his boots now? Yeah. 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 Look at the state of them. They've been snored away, mate. State of them. Anyone got a brush or what? Ready for today? I've been ready for like the last three weeks. <laughs> it's been so long. I 
thought, yeah, just nice for two weeks, come back quick. But no, it's been like five. So it's just so dirty. Have those boots not seen any sunlight since? They've just been tucked away in the shed. They're seeing dust. So no good. But it's been a long time, hasn't it? <laughs> Shouldn't have smashed him, though. Yeah, they've come on, haven't they? It's a new airstyle, isn't it? Oh, what's that? Yeah, the jet, you know what I mean? Tonga Do you guys watch the ITV thing? Yeah, a bit awkward, wasn't it? <laughs> yeah, they're rolling the ball, mate. Do you cooked it, I would have just punched it in the smithy. Do you all love each other? So, so uh, for girls coming out today, giving it one of them. <laughs> I'm glad it wasn't me, mate. Imagine us on telly. Been awful. Bad, bad <laughs> you, you, would have, you would have had more minutes on, on the TV <laughs> oh, than you would on the pitch. There you go. There you go. Sounds like 50p in Jack, isn't it? Fucking bloke. Starting the day. So. Oh, really? Yeah. yeah. We, we, Miracle, isn't it? There you go. Missed an open goal and I fing start somehow. <laughs> yeah, Elliot's angle did not yeah, do that, really. Just hold him one goal. Did you? Getting them more no, early. 1 0 early, early doors. doors. 1 0 early doors. <laughs> first one. Yeah, mate. First one over there. <laughs> Love you, Tom. You can film me or my agent speak to either one. I just don't do that. 10 seconds of fame. No, like, 10 seconds of fame. Yeah. I wondered what part they were going to put in, but um, they chose the f***ing weirdest comment. <laughs> it was all like around the TV, like eating your dinner, your mum, dad, and that. Come on, and your dad just went, You f***ing idiot. <laughs> Take it away, Mary! <laughs> She was a nice lady, wasn't she? Yeah. I thought it was a decent little two minutes on the TV though, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah, they done it well. Um, yeah, she was, yeah, I thought she was well good. Yeah. Well, easy to talk to. Yeah. We were talking and she went, you are so interesting as a person. <laughs> and I went, thank you. I said, last time, the last person to say something about me was, uh, someone said I had the personality of a lamppost. <laughs> and now I'm interested. <laughs> How far I've come in the space of a couple of months. <laughs> Right, Back on right. coffee today, mate. Right. To yeah? How did we cough, mate? Is that gain the edge socks as well? Yeah, mate. Lids. Strap it up again. Do you know what I mean? I've got a lovely uh, yellow pair. Have you? I'll bring if you want. Yeah, give them to I me. Think I think they'll go good with the with the kit. I've got I've got a pink what? pair, but we're kind of gone with that. Yellow? Yeah. My kit's burgundy. Yeah, but it'll just make you stand out. Nah, bro. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not that guy, bro. That's like cooks in them, man, there. <laughs> I'm that guy, I don't stand out. I wear black boots, just humble, innit? You know what no, I'm saying? No, the black and yellow looks clean. No, no, that's not no, me. No. That's not me, Trust me. That's, Trust not me. me bro. <laughs> that's not me, bro. That's not me. Yeah, we sort of, you know, we, we love each other. <laughs> 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 I'm thinking of doing that in the game today. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure, I go, I love you. Yeah, you know, me, you know, we, we, we were so in love. Did you score today a little love heart to the camera? Yeah, we just love it, don't we? You've got to do that, mate. You want to look a big hug, innit? <laughs> we spent about 25 minutes, me taking penalties, and like, yeah, this is the last shot, so we got to get it right, then you put it in. Oh, they haven't, have they? Oh, yeah, I forgot about that. I kept missing them as well. Oh, mate. Hello, Bath. Hello. You got, to pay, you got to pay to film me now, mate. <laughs> we're uh, we're moving up in the world. It's Independent good. ITV. Yeah. Yeah. What did, what did you think? Did you watch it last yeah, night? Yeah, yeah, I did. Hey, got my popcorn ready. Bond yet? Either have they? For the new Bond. The new James I know, Bond. Yeah. I thought you, you carried yourself quite you look, well. I think you look very. I thought I came across there. quite well. Yeah. 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 I thought I did. But um, I mentioned it to you yesterday. I don't think sort of like reporting's really my. Forte. Mm. He had like a cheeky smile, didn't he? Oh, Did you see that? He saw like <laughs> he was like flirting with the camera. The lovely bond. <laughs> the uh, the reporting's good for me, but I think my true passion lies in like a game show host. I think that's where I'd I'd he thrive. A bit of Michael Barrymore about him, isn't he? <laughs> I was going Paddy, not Paddy McGuinness. Well, not like a not like Cube or like he wants to be a millionaire. <laughs> no, intelligent one. I mean like a you know he has a bit of. Back and forth with the audience, you know. Yeah, a little bit of yeah, live, yeah, no, like off, off, off the, the cuff, off the cuff yeah. banter. Yeah, yeah. yeah. We, we, <laughs> I'll, I'll put together a little quiz and you'll host it at the end of the season. Yeah, we'll, yeah. Well up for that. we'll do like yeah. season long. They're bringing quiz. out the old, all the old ones now, and a bullseye. I think bullseye. you've got a bit of bullseye. bullseye. Yeah, bullseye. Mm -hmm. I think you, yeah, yeah, a bit of old Jim Bowen. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> here's what you could have won. And all that. <laughs> 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 hell. Who, what game show does that when you fucking lose? I like it. Look at this speedboat you could have won. <laughs> deal or no deal. <laughs> deal, or no deal. <laughs> Could have had half a mil here, you've won four pounds. <laughs>
We could do a Farnham and Dean or no deal, couldn't we? I'd yeah. Yeah, that'd be no, sick. That'd be, that'd be good. You know what else? I hate you saying yesterday, like a um, like a darts match. Yeah. In, I think that'd be unreal, Class, mate. Class. But like 101, <laughs> not 501, <not> because <laughs> it'd be there all day. <laughs> yeah, who would be doing the f***ing adding up on that? There ain't a lot who would be very good on the old maths on that, would there? Yeah, not Flatty, that's for sure. <laughs> not Flatty. Flatty could have... He could be... I'm <laughs> 80! <laughs> that could be Flatty. That'd be his job. <laughs> Well, we are getting the police tonight. Or we could get uh, one like, like the goals in the game. Like such a big old cuddle. Yeah. Yeah. Grab, grab everyone over. Yeah. <laughs> Come on, we'll call Moto Dogo, he's still cuddled. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, lovely. Well, can't leave it left that in. Oh, mate. Killed him. Killed didn't him, didn't he? Yeah. Well, he said it like a fucking plum, didn't I he? I know. I'm like, that was a. That was a bit though where she was like, right, I just need to ask the questions to like get get it for my mic, like get that audio. And then yeah. Smithy's just answered like, and they've left it in, mate. I said Leo Stewart, sales and marketing manager at Nafford Health. <laughs> yes, I've been fun and do a lot of work in the in the community, which is very much something that Nafford Health is very much our sort of ethos. Um, yeah, we we really liked that. We want to to work with um, Farnham. We want to grow our sort of. Um, presence in the community and help give back and I think especially farmers work with uh, the food bank especially as something we think yeah we think is absolutely great. What we're going to be providing is a selection of uh, diagnostic imaging um, as well as gym memberships to Farnham so we're going to be looking after their well-being very much the health and well-being partner um, for yeah the upcoming future. I think very much it's a long-term partnership. This project is certainly something that that seems as if it's going to be lasting for a very long time. It's, it's something everyone around here believes in and yeah, I think Nuffield Health certainly believe in it. We just want to support Farnham as much as we can, really. Well, I sort of head up Farnham's community outreach uh, locally, going to different schools to give out free school tickets and partner with them. Also talking to charities, um, Phyllis Tuckwell just like, moved offices right next to the ground. So liaison with them to try to see how we can partner and how we can really benefit uh, sort of like the Farnham community as a whole. Like our demographic is, is children and families. Um, each school we go to they get free, a free family ticket per pupil. So that means the parents can come down, their siblings can come down, their cousins, their friends, whoever else can all come down, uh, all free of price. And hopefully we create such an atmosphere they want to come back and they want to you know, contribute more to Farnham, to the youth teams, they buy a bit of merchandise, they follow us on social media and uh, yeah, they really buy into the club and sort of like our vision. So Nuffield, uh, they've reached out to us, um, it's been a kind of a long time coming, we sort of like initially signed everything that was ready in uh, the start of November, uh, but just trying to get different signatures on the line, um, but yeah, really they're really focused on us as a club, you know, they can see the, the growth we've got, they can see how we're progressing as a team on and off the pitch. So, um, you know, want to jump on board our journey as well and uh, help help the local community here and help the players and benefits all round actually, so, yeah, it's good. Yeah, it's amazing, amazing. Um, on two levels really, one obviously we can have a, a common ground to keep all the players, you know, fit and strong and, and develop the programmes that we've set for them. Um, whether that's in season or off season, and then obviously the scanning, free scanning is unbelievable because um, that obviously cuts out all our guesswork on on a potential injury or an actual injury, um, and then gives us an indication of very accurate severity, so we can work out exactly the rehab protocol or initially the exact problem um, and nature of the injury, and then obviously relate that back to the to the rehab uh, and the length of time out. Um, it takes all the guesswork away. It's a very professional approach, obviously, to have access to a scan pretty quickly after an injury. Um, so, yeah, I mean, all for it. Amazing. Brilliant. I mean, it's the sort of access you only get with either private health or as you climb up the leagues considerably, to be honest with you. So, yeah, no, it's a massive help. Um, it takes the stress out of an injury because obviously players not knowing how long they're going to be out for or what actually is wrong um, is amazing. Um, and then it helps us for the conditioning side because we have a clear indication of what's wrong so we can adapt whatever it is that they do accurately. So it's, it's brilliant, yeah, it's really good. Another ball to add to the side, but yeah, massive well done to Harry and Frank and, and the boys and getting that one done, especially, you know, for the players, um, the membership there, um, having a large part of our team being local, they get to use their facility. Um, 
with the scans as well as a player it gives you that little bit of protection and a little bit of cover that you know you're going to be looked after. Um, so yes, yeah, it's, it's another, you know, as for myself, it's another selling point um, to attract players to the club, um, good players to the club, and uh, yeah, big thanks to Nutfield Health um, for taking us on board. Just had the mayor come down, first time he's actually been to Farnham Town Football Club. You know, so you know, upward trajectory with the, the right people in the in the town. Uh, great to see him come down, and enjoy it. Uh, Farnham Town uh, Council have, uh, have put an advertising board around the around the uh, around the grounds, which is great. But yeah, for, for us, it's great to continue to be the, this hub, this central point in the town. Um, and hopefully we, we prove that today with another great attendance um, and hopefully another win. JJ was saying, like, when they were watching it, in terms of the two f***ing wide players and all that, were, were they too high and wide? I said, no, I think the two centre midfielders go too wide. Yeah, they're they're too wide. wide. And realistically, when we lose it, there should always be that block of four. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. You don't want Lamar. Lamar's playing out right back. Oh, they're playing here. Yeah. 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 yeah, so they're the comfort zone and, you know, you, you want to encourage them to get wide with the, with the recovery of the block of four as a f***ing, as, as a safe zone, you know yeah. what I mean? I, I, think, I think when they got to beat them two out wide, I think yeah. he, he was going like right up. Yeah, yeah, 100%. Right up there. Yeah. And JJ was up there. Yeah. And the midfield, like, he can just support. Yeah, but like, it's just the timing. Of, as, as that comes round, it's just the timing yeah. of the right back here. Oh. Then it's the timing of it, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. But yeah. then we should always have these, there's that block of four. Oh. If they happen to lose it, yeah. then they recover. Then, then they just recover. Yeah, Cooks in the marsh should play literally five. Where that red cone is. Yeah, correct. Yeah, yeah. for that. Yeah. Never go yeah. No, no. Uh, but the other day you had one out here. Oh, yeah, one then here. we lost it, and it was just the two centre halves. Yeah, Cookie was here. Lamar yeah. was over there. Yeah, but what I'm saying is, I think when we got it, the responsibility shouldn't be always for them left and right back. It should be the two centre halves, yeah, centre, yeah. centre midfielders in front of the centre halves as a block first. Oh, yeah, yeah. Then the others recover. But yeah. I get it. Don't go too gun hole too far. Yeah. Just find that right balance, yeah. isn't it? Yeah. Hey, that is the key, innit? Yeah, enjoy what we do. Yeah, enjoy it. The harder we work, the more we enjoy it and make sure we're on it. And to see what they do, yeah, over at their place, yeah, they went the wing back, sat the two wing backs in deep and just invited us on all the time. See what they do again. If they do that, make sure we fucking take full advantage. If they changed it to the one in the hole, three up top, yeah, comfortable with that. Make sure we're aggressive with what we do, yeah, take the initiative in there, fucking make sure the talking's there. Don't wait for something to happen on who's picking someone up dictate people, fucking push them around, put them around, get what needs to be done. Make sure our fucking fullbacks, every time their wide boys touch it, we're nice and aggressive and we're tight. Two centre half striker goes in with fucking nice and tight up his ass. yeah. They sit one in the hole, yeah, more of you, Lamar, yeah, that goes around him, yeah, unless Ryan can step out, you mark from the front, Ryan does from behind, or Jacko. Make sure the talking's then we get that sorted. And we're just aggressive with them. Yeah, we're aggressive with them. Then we win the ball and then we're playing. Yeah, and then it's all about us and the quality we have on the ball. Just make sure the fucking talking's there and the body language is there, yeah? I don't want fucking the same people, yeah? I don't want it being fucking Cooks, yeah? I don't want it being fucking Ryan. Liz coming back in, Jacko. I want everybody involved, yeah? I want fucking, if it ain't right, if you see something, can tell them, take it on the chin, accept it, get the job done. Yeah, get back in here at half time, then we talk about it if we need to. But I don't think we will need to because we're fucking so much better than what they are. Yeah, so it's all about what we do. Good with the ball, our work off the ball. Make sure we follow things up, we get runners in behind, and we fucking enjoy what we do. Yeah, let's go. Hello from the Memorial Ground, and welcome to this coverage of Farnham Town versus Hawley Town. Areas, areas, out your feet, areas. Rawley, Lamar, JJ, JJ, can stick the ball in here. Oi, Peta, well done! Jacko, excellent here, good start, mate, well done. 
Right, right. Talk to Lamar. The 10, you might take him when he comes on. Lamar pushes on one. Three stands up. JJ, much better in there. Oi, stretch them first. I need did, to don't... stretch them first. Don't go missing. Keep doing it. Don't go fucking missing. Good, go on then, 2v1. Kirks, well done, oh, you two, Lamar, Lamar, come on. Don't go missing, just keep getting on it. Kirky, if you get it, yeah, if you get it, the switch every time, yeah. Don't even look to play in here, just open your body up and go. Got to get something, got to get something. And relax. Dean Rule will chase. Cuts inside, Dean Rule. And yes! Edwards was a beauty, and the striker could not miss from there. Hey, hey, get him out, yeah? Frightening start. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, well done. <laughs> Calm it down now. Calm it down, all right? Just watch the 10, yeah? Try and leave so we push out the mark. What I'm saying yeah, about that man. man. With, with his kicking, when well, you're dropping off, and these fucking piggies zinging that long one, if, that, if his kick had accurate, we lose it, we're all over the show, you know what I mean? So he's got to decide. Well, I'm saying to these boys, once they get tired, as much as you want to play, yeah. they're, they're pressing yeah, so high. You don't even have to be good. Don't even look, just keep clipping it, that's what I'm saying. But then they drop off, then we can play. We, we don't need, we can just earn the right to do that first. They lost the ball, they just ran in the box. Yeah. Oh. Just be an option, JJ. Just be an option, leave him to it. Oh, that's the one. Wait, well done. JJ, excellent, well done. Head down, head down, head down. Good. Keep his head down, Kirk's going in. Head down, JJ. Better. Daz, that one over the top's on all the time. Just encourage Shams just to stay the other side of him. Well done, mate. See that one at the end, where the last 10 minutes you started dropping off that little bit. See when Smithy's got it, drop off, you tighten you go into that gap or level with him, squeeze his dad's space and all that. All of a sudden you get it out, two passes, you back out again. Been perfect, mate. Last 10 minutes was that much better. Or otherwise, you drop off, sometimes Smithy can go straight into Cooks. Do you get what I mean? Yeah, just, to, just if Smithy's got it, just drop that little bit deeper in him, obviously depending where he is on the pitch, but just allow that, allow that space in front of you to be big. It gives you more time on the ball. You get it, do you get what I mean? It's one of them, yeah. It's a little bit, a bit of a strange half that. Yeah, I think we've got to understand sometimes games ain't always how they pan out or how we want them to pan out to be. Yeah, and we, we've wasted a little bit of time in terms of what we wanted to do. Yeah, it's so erratic in there. Fair play. They're running at everything and they're closing everything and they want to commit bodies forward. Sometimes we've just got to have a little, have a little thing, slow things down and just bypass everything.
Yeah, because all our all the joy has come from us just bypassing everything, yeah, and putting it in and getting it into the channels. And if it goes, then we pick up second balls. Just got to get a bit better on the second ball, understanding when the ball goes. At the moment, we're under hitting things. Yeah, can we over hit things? It's a half hour smithy for the first one to like fucking just whip it right round that. And that, that's it every time. Every time you get the ball, it's just that. Open your body up, whip it round. Don't even look. Yeah, and then we get down the pitch and then we play in their final third. It'd be, it'd be exactly the same. Yeah, it'd be a frantic start to the second half again. Yeah, if we try and play, it's the pitch is a little bit bobbling. It's not um, playing to our strengths at the minute because they're so erratic and so fast at us. That after 15 minutes, the game will fucking they, they will slow down and then we can open it up and then we can pop the ball. But 15 minutes, we just got to look to get in behind. Yeah, get up the pitch, pick up second ball, and then we play from 35 yards outside there. After then, Cookie dictates it and we go out the other way. At the moment, we're just fixated one side. Yeah, one side. Whatever side the ball falls to, and we can, whoever it falls to, is can we open our body up and just get that ball out the other side? Normally, it's been Daz that's been the other side, and he's on every time. Yeah, he just sees the picture and he's gone. So can we find it, one touch, and just without even looking, can we just go out that way? And they'll weigh every time. Then it's just decision-making in the final third. They're so high shams, yeah, you don't need to be offside. Yeah, it's a little bit lazy in terms of, the ball goes down, then you're sort of off, like you're not involved in the game, half walking back, but then we win it, and then you're off. Yeah, you've got to get involved, get back on side, open your body up, and keep encouraging that ball. Yeah, keep encouraging. Never be square to the game. Yeah, always open that body up. Yeah, telling dads, I want the ball, get the dads, get the ball. Just make sure talking's good. Yeah, don't go within yourselves. Like I say, they've got 15 minutes. They're, they're all right. Yeah, what they're doing, they're not bad. They want to commit bodies forward. Can we pass? Can we pass? Body's over, yeah, a lot of time you're going with a 10. Can you speak to Ryan or Jacko, yeah, to pass the 10 over, then you release, because he's coming too deep, yeah. Then you can release him, then Rawley's the one that stands the other side of the midfielders. And then when we win it, yeah, then it's Rawley, yeah, to the ball, or it's Daz. But can we release everyone on one? Yeah, I'm, I'm comfortable for us to go one-on-one -on -one at the back. Yeah, go nice and tight. More than comfortable one-on-one, -on -one, then we've got the extra man. Yeah, a little bit too easy coming through for some reason when we're boxed up there. Yeah, got it? Yeah, everyone good? Yeah, yeah hey, hey, come on, hey. Kicking that end now, yeah, it's fucking 15 minutes of fucking graft, yeah, then we're fucking playing our football. Well done. Shamsi, Shamsi, your runs, if I'm the centre half, say, say JJ's got it, and that right hand side, if I'm the centre half, if you stand there, I'd, if, if I want to see you and the ball, if I'm the centre half and I can see you just, and I can see the ball, I'm happy days. But if I'm like that, and I have to drop deep to see it, that's exactly what I don't want to be, because you can go either way, do you know what I mean? If you're sort of standing there, and uh, you're standing there, and I'm like that, and JJ's, it's beautiful for me. But if you could just stand just a little bit off him, and they want, they want to be able to feel you and see you, and if they can't, you're a nightmare to mark. So keep doing that, mate, yeah? You all right? Good. Good. Come on, son. Come on, son. You all right? <laughs> Come on, boys. How are you feeling, all right? Yeah, so try to give me an hour's Yeah, fucking, mate, to be fair, it's going to be. The, 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 the first 10, 15 minutes, always, it's just your timings. Yeah, right. yeah. yeah, just the church. You don't realise how much time you've got in this left mate, honestly. But, but the good thing is, is your, fucking, when your, your timing of your head is perfect, mate. Spot on, yeah. Well done, boys. Well done. Come on, Jack, turn me up, baby. Turn me up. Turn me up, baby. <laughs> no, move your hand a little bit higher. How's my barnet looking? I will Photoshop it. Yes, come on then. Can you give me like a full set? Yes, here yeah, we go. Full set of head, head of hair. Rule yeah. A, lead, come on, come on, here we come. Dazza, <laughs> where are you going? Wait, come on, come on, all of us f***ing lively. <laughs> you said that very quietly. <laughs> come on in, here we come, yeah, we'll do two. We'll yeah, do no, two, nothing yeah. silly, nothing silly. On the move. That's going to get his job. Right, two sprints, here we go. On your toes then, on your toes, in and out. Yep. Fucking quicker than that lid. One more, in for a header and then out. Yes, come on, one more, you two. Easy, easy, on the fucking clap, yeah. I love it, innit? Well done, boys. Woo! Turn me up, Jack boy. Turn me up, boy. Come on. Now we play. Oi, right, better areas, right? Oi, right, well done, Lamar. Better areas, mate. Well done. Oh. 
Oh! Unlucky! He goes short this time. Go on in! Bubble in there, go on in! It was a bit risky. Yeah! D rule! Get in there, oi, well done. Good. Oi, 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 just encourage it, just that, 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 that. In there, you don't want to play in there. You do not want to play in there. That's what we were doing. That's what you said, you set up half his everywhere. Yeah, Lidl was going yeah, to nick yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. That's what we were trying to do. Just make sure we're setting traps up, the body shape's right, yeah. Daz is brilliant, man. Everything comes inside, yeah? We've plenty of time, but do you look at Baldy going on one for Shams? And then Kai coming in. Yeah. And then then Maldi for yeah. uh, Possums. Yeah. Uh, uh, Jack has got 15 minutes. For Max? Yeah. And then uh, Brandon for Swiffy. Yeah. And who for Thing? Uh, yeah. Brandon for. No, who got time? Oh. Uh, we were going to put Maldi up one. Yeah. Let him float, but then that moves this to stretch it. Yeah. And then Charlie for Maldi. For uh, Shams, you're talking about, yeah? Yeah. Yeah. Like 15 20 minutes when it opens up a bit, and then that, then maybe Charlie at the end for lids or something like that. Yeah, well, well then Rolly uh, for thing, yeah, 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 yeah. Start growing my leg hairs again, mate. I'm not doing bad, are you? <laughs> Take it off your legs and put them in your head. <laughs> just pull, oh. mate. Just pull, mate. Hey, just pull, really. <laughs> How can you crack jokes like that when you're on a bench? Get <laughs> 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 used to it, mate. <laughs> He's in, he's in. Oh. Oh, lucky. Yeah, it's good. Needed to come a bit earlier, didn't it? Come on, boys, eh? Come on, son. Come on, let's go. Impact. Taxi. You going for Rolly? Just Rolly up one. Yeah. Defending corner. Guy. Go near post hole. Yeah, attacking. You're going to keep him. Get uh, Nick to attack the ball. Excellent, Jacko. Well done, son. You all right? Sandy! Well done. Move me! Get out to the f***ing ball. Unlucky. Toe pun there, I would have. Oh, I would have toe pun. Right on! And the man on! Oh, mother. Hi, unlucky! Unlucky, roll it! Oi, Lamar. Excellent. Excellent, mate. Cooksley wins it back and Farnham have numbers. Harry Cooksley across the box and it's going Yay! to the There he is! Get in there! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Good there, yeah. baby! Good in there! Oh. Hey, good boy. <laughs> yes, yeah, Rudy's back, eh? Good boy. Play better, my baby. Come on, go on, get your suit. Come in there. Yeah, come in back. Oh. Oh. Yeah. <laughs>
I'm out drinking tonight. Bring back Flatty. <laughs> Standing over the corner. It's aimed towards Ryan Canane, who wins his header. Flicked on and pushed into the <laughs> Yeah! <laughs> we, we just said it's got to be on his more his toes. I think he's sort of fought him. <laughs> He scored, though, yeah. <laughs> it's all f***ing second in the league. That was cross, though. <laughs> Joe, well done! It's such a perfect day. Bad boys. Bad boys. Bad boys. Bad boys. Bad boys. Bad Goal and assist, mate. Goal and assist. Goal and Light work. Keep the old goal involvement for 90 down, that does. It's good to be back in the score sheet. Are you falling over as that? <laughs> Just trying to stretch my neck as much as I could, mate. Goal's the goal. Yeah. Just got to realise, like, That's what I'm saying. Turn it more but, than like, it's, it's identified early on just to clip it in. Yeah. So so when you see Cooks and your dad's in there, you naturally want to play it in there, don't you? Well done, mate, today. Well done. Like, yeah, like, yeah. So you pretty, Stretch him, then yeah. Yeah. Yeah, 100%. Move that Oh, yeah. Oh, 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 this bit of bottom. <laughs> <laughs> well, well done, yeah, second half. Yeah, f***ing adapted to it, did the right thing. It will not like our best footballing display, but you're going to get that, yeah, from time to time. you just got to understand the game when you're in playing in the game, yeah, how quick you can adapt to the conditions and, and what they're doing. Yeah, I think in future, can you pick up a little bit quicker in the first half and get it done a little bit quicker because we could have got it done quicker. But second half, real good, yeah, everyone stepped up to the plate. The game didn't drop down. And we kept going and we could have had a couple more. So well done. We rolled on Tuesday, yeah. We just go again, take another one off, and we go again with Rufus again. Well, well, well done, boys. Well, nice well, well, I awesome. love you all, by the way. <laughs>
Well, that was exciting at the end. 4-0, another great win, another clean sheet for the boys and really kind of got us past that horrible Vars defeat and I feel like the spirits are back up after a really exciting week as well. That's 19 wins out of 19, 57 points out of 57 and we roll on to Tuesday here again. Abbey Rangers who scored late to beat... Who did Abbey Rangers beat? Who did Abbey Rangers beat? Abbey Rangers beat someone 1-0 and uh, continuing their their mount uh, on the playoff spot. So it's going to be a tough game down here. Charlie Possum's playing against his former club. Let's get over to the Memorial Ground here on Tuesday. Welcome back to the Memorial Ground. We are here on Tuesday night on what is quite a mild night, although I'm wearing a coat. It's actually pretty mild. Might take that off in a minute. It is Abbey Rangers at home. They're third in the league. It's probably going to be one of our stiffest tests this entire season and they will be right up for it, stopping us making it 20 out of 20 tonight if we can. We're still the only team in Europe that is unbeaten and 100% record. So hopefully we can make it 20 out of 20 tonight. But it's over to the boys. The characters got to fulfil it. Uh, we're missing a few for, from injury tonight. I think Jack Dean's out. I think Joe Jackson's out. Flatty suspended. Owen Dean suspended last game. So... Uh, you know, I wouldn't say we're up against it, we've got plenty plenty to, to make this happen, but it's a big, big ask. 20 games, 20 wins, 60 points. It would put us 11 points clear at the top of the table with two games in hand. Can the boys do it? Let's see today. Yeah, Max meeting centre half now. Yeah, well, boy. Get a bit closer, I reckon. <laughs> <laughs> am I starting again? I think so. Nah, I don't think board. I am, mate. Nah, it's yeah. old board. Old hey, board. You're in, you're in some. Now. Yeah. Flying, mate. Two starts in a row, Jesus. Can't remember the last time that happened. Nah, never. <laughs> I've had my charity man of the match. <laughs> Chaz will get tonight if he scores. Well, I'm sure. Old club here, get a little, little tap in. Is there, is there a lot of people still at Abbey from when you were there? Uh, there's a few. I don't know how many. I haven't really been keeping an eye on it, if I'm honest. Um, a couple. I'm sure I'll get some sick tonight from someone. But I'll have the last yeah, laugh once we win three points. Like a Tuesday night game, um, coming off the back of Saturday with a good crowd. So hopefully, you know, Tuesday night we can produce a good crowd as well and another good game. Abbey Rangers, yeah, good side. Um, this will be a massive test for us tonight. They're, they, they, you know, they're in good form. Uh, their manager have been here a while. They know the league in and out. Yeah, unlucky not to have gone up in the past few years, but. I think this season, obviously, with the playoffs, they got half a chance. So, yeah, they're a good, consistent side and they'll be tough today. You know what you're going to get from them. And, uh, yeah, another test for us. You've got to play everyone, don't matter where they are in the league. You know, bottom of the table can cause you problems. So, yeah, they, they, um, they're up there challenging for the playoffs and the, and the league. So, it should, be a, it should be a good test tonight. Yeah, Chaz's old club um, that we got him from last year where he had a good season. He's, uh, he's on the bench for us tonight, so he'll be chomping on a bit to get on and, uh, and prove a point tonight. Yeah, well, obviously, Jacko's had a long time out and uh, pushed him through two games. So he, he's a little bit tight um, around the glute area. So um, he's on the bench tonight, but try not to look to use him. And then uh, Joe Jackson picked up an ankle knock. You know, he's, he's available for us tonight, but it's one that, you know, we don't want to risk or, or make it worse. Brandon comes in. Obviously, it's not natural position, not ideal, but Brandon comes in tonight at right back. Yeah, Dean Rule starting. Um, maybe a little bit harsh on Kai. I thought he was excellent the other week. But Rooley, Rooley's got so much ability, and uh, hopefully, we, we saw that Saturday, especially the first half. Um, hopefully, um, he'll produce it again tonight. <laughs> what was that? So I played everywhere else, now it's keeping it On target though. No, I wasn't close to going. <laughs> <laughs> what's, what's wrong with you? Um, ankles sort of been playing up a little bit, like um, for, for a little while now. So it's more just wear and tear, I think. I think it should be off Saturday. So I mean, like, if they need me tonight, I'll play. Yeah. Um, not with Pat. Uh, but needs must I think Jack's sort of in a similar boat as well. So now you're on keeper duties. Yeah, keeper duties now. It's quite interesting. I like learning about all different positions and what other people do. And Pat's one of the best, so it's good to learn off of Oi, a little bit quiet all around, isn't it, boys? Don't mind it. Just make sure we're at it, eh? Make sure we're f***ing at it from that whistle all round. Just got to touch up, yeah? Just getting back, because I think we're getting back to it, yeah? We're looking good in uh, large patches of the game. And again, it'll be good today. 
don't take winning for granted. Yeah, do not take thinking, oh, you just turn up, oh, sort of like, we know what we're doing. Yeah, we've got to get better at it again. I think we just dropped off it because we think we're going to win every game. Yeah, don't expect us to win every game. But make sure, yeah, don't get lazy with it. Liz drops in, Sam plays high, Daz and Rawley play on the outside, yeah, followed up by Cookie and Lamar. Listen, yeah, Ryan pulls you along, yeah, Ryan pulls you along, Lamar, you're the one that goes in, yeah. Tell Daz, tell Rawley, yeah, where you're going, and you go and win the ball back as a group. Yeah, don't be silent in there. Need cookie round you, cookie f encourage encourager constantly. Come on, boys, let's go. Come on, come on. Come on. Everything good, yeah, tonight. On, yeah, we set the tempo, right, we set the f***ing atmosphere. On. Let's go. Welcome to this coverage of Farnham Town versus Abbey Rangers. The beginning of the second half okay. of the campaign. Okay. Brand, remember, always give yourself enough time. Hey, when you get it, give yourself enough time if you need to shift it onto that left foot. Yeah, keep yourself on the byline. First touch is right. You got three? Yes, well then. Hey, you've got to have on fucking... You know, you're one name with the old the bottom, aren't you? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Another header from Neaton. But it's an early chance here for Abby. And the shot there from Murdoch, just yeah, over the bar. Just, no, just put it in. The first thing you know. Good, keep hold of it. Here's Brandon Kalou. Fine, I'm happy to keep the ball at the moment, but great pass. Daryl Sanders crosses in early, and Edwards is there. Oh, oh a chance. And there was a crucial defending there, which denied good. Edwards. Right, good start, son. Oi, well done. He's got to score. Has to score. Has to score, innit? Smithy! Smithy! Creep out! Hey, creep out! Delivery has to be so much better! Too many times! Here's Sanders looking for the early cross and it was Not towards Lidl. Yeah. It's going to come for Dean Rule. Edwards had a chance for his left foot and it's off the line. Really quick thinking from Farnham to create that chance. Hold your dance back. <laughs> Don't go too wide, Roy. You only get headed back across. Get in. Lamar, give yourself a little bit more. That'll do. That's it. <laughs> You, again, you've got your f***ing... Oh. I think Ryan's moving, he's got to be ending it in the box. Yeah. He's ending it out there, again. Any. Huh? Yeah, he, but he, he's ending yeah. it out here again. Yeah, just ending it back in. Yeah, it's, it, 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 when he was headed, he wants to be on goal. Yeah. He, all he's doing is feeding it back in. Yeah, yeah, but, yeah, but yeah. even yeah, even Saints though, just like got aim for the back post, like just hanging one up, like more of a drill. See, so coming onto it. Long it goes, and it's Sanders that's chasing it down. He gambled, shoot, Little outside of the foot. Well, it was a great effort. It just whistled wide from Adam Little. Forward it comes from Nash. Edwards this time gets up. Great flick. And it's flicked on again there by Sanders. And here's Dean Rule on the right-hand side, cutting into the penalty area. Dean Rule across the face of the goal. Yeah. And it's flicked in by Adam Little. And Farnham take the lead in the 13th minute. Such an added close when it is that ball, didn't it? <laughs> right. Every time we win it, it just goes out to the full See on, the, full see ball, on yeah. them free kicks when we get them, they put them in. F***ing stack, just go centre of the f***ing box. Okay. Yeah, because they're just trying to get you on it, and all your headers do is just get, as a defender, you'll read that header anyway. I think if you're, you're the focal point like central, correct. Yes, mate. Well, they good for it. Well done, mate. Oi, keep them going. Who scored? Who scored? Huh? <laughs> yeah. Lizzie! Yeah. Hey, well hey, done, son! Let's go again! Well done, boy! Tom Smith, forward, and that's perfect for Shamal Edwards, who's got the pace here. And Shamal Edwards is in. Dean Rule's with him. Dean Rule! Yeah! Two -nil! yeah! Shamal Edwards deserves every single bit of credit he gets there. Yes. Get in there. <coughs> Oi, 
Can get in. Well done, right, you good. two. Hey, good. Well done, son. Hey, well done. Come on, ball. Well done. Minutes, hang good enough. Hey, don't leave me hanging. <laughs> <laughs> hey, well done. Hey, get on it. Hey, come on, let's finish this off second half. First half. Let's finish this fucking first half. Come on. Keep them on it, Coach. Keep them on it, right. James! James, excellent. Every time they touch it, we run it. Brad, hey, well done, son. Good. Rule A. Well done, mate. Oh, let's go again. Abby have had time to get back in. He just needs to understand. His Sanders. Little. Shoot. He does get a shot off. And it's going to be a corner kick to Farnham after the save there. Hey, good foot, bro. Well done. Karoma. Nadal. And here's Sanders. Looking to round off Shoot. this lovely Farnham move. Little! Oh. <laughs> that would have been beautiful. It would have been beautiful. I didn't count the number of passes, but it was a gorgeous Farnham move. And Edwards with the slide tackle. Kalu just beaten to it there by a penny. But the perseverance pays off. And here's Dean Rule in space, and he's provided the goal already from that position, and he's almost oh. done it again. Daryl Sanders coming into the six-yard box. Rudy, Rudy, Rudy! Dean Rule is there on the overlap, and here he is again in that dangerous position of his. Shoot. Rule! And that's another great save. And Edwards with over a kick. And how oh, it's only 2-0 at this They're stage. They're riding their luck now, Abby Rangers. <coughs> Rule, excellent, oi! Rule, excellent, mate, well done! Every time. Mate. One more is outside. Good boy, Smith. One more outside. Well done. Oh, we're just we're just dying out the little bits here because it, it's real close to being a real good performance, like enjoyable performance. But we're just dying out the little bits of like just real sloppy like stuff. Yeah, that you sh shouldn't expect. And it's only happened on occasions at times. Make sure you round the second ball in the box. Yeah, three four times it's dropped in there. Yeah, no one near it. The fucking tappings. Yeah, tappings. Kill the game. This game should be done, shouldn't it? Yeah, fucking real good chances. Dave yeah. made a couple of good saves. So we start the second half fucking on the front foot. We're going to score and we're going to enjoy it, yeah? The tempo doesn't drop throughout the game, yeah? The tempo doesn't drop throughout the game. We're fucking bang, we're relentless. There was a real good spell uh, 15 minutes in. As soon as they touched the ball, fucking front three were all over them. Yeah, they couldn't fucking breathe. Get back on that, squash them, yeah? It's that close to being a real fucking good performance. Just real sloppy bits that shouldn't happen. Yeah, that's it. Just get them out of the game. Understand the game. Yeah, it's into Cooks, out to the full back, into Cooks, then into Daz and Rawley. Yeah, excellent Rawley first half. Yeah, make sure I ain't fucking one off. It's again, yeah, again, constant threat. But good, yeah, fucking make sure. Got a buzz when we go back out, yeah? It's been good, well done. Anything? Shant, Shant! Hey, Ref! Referee! How many fucking more? Referee, come on, mate. That's terrible, ref. Kane looking long. Edwards just bending his run, and the flag stays down. Done well. Waits for the really support, well. which comes in the form of Sanders, who plays in Adam Liddle! Uh, and he just snatched at his effort. Hey, well done. Really good football, but a missed opportunity for Adam Liddle. Come away, Lids! Come away, Lids! Four oh, Daz, four Daz. for you're Farnham. In. Here's Sanders. Shoot. And Adam Liddle has some time. Cuts onto his right foot and shoots. Just took a deflection and made it easier for Sam Gray. Another chance goes begging for Farnham. I can't believe he didn't take it first time. It's a bit small, then. I, I, thought, to touch him I thought he was just going to run through. Yeah. I thought but the defenders come across to the right. No! Fuck. Smithy, you f***ing winding me up! You f***ing muck! 
Yeah. Red card all day long. All day long. Fucking red. 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 Fucking Come on, get back on it now, that's gone. Fantastic. Okay. Fucking disgusting. Yeah. Yeah. Love to know what he's saying. Yeah. Yeah. You're right. Yeah. I've kicked the ball. You're right. He's chopped me. Yeah, it's it's exactly. He only goes in one. Is it? Yeah, it's still bad. Yeah. Yeah. Terrible. Fucking stick Daryl Sanders for Farnham. And just couldn't Unlucky. Unlucky. find the target that time. Unlucky. Okay, right, pick it up, pick it up, let's go! Hey, Lamar, come on! Kamara. At the, enjoying... reg, at the reg, Madrick. A bit of possession, but Sanders swoops in. And Daryl Sanders scores! Yay! Having missed a few opportunities earlier, Daryl Sanders gets his name on the score sheet, and it's Farnham 3, Abbey Rangers 0 at the clock end. Another port. He's in it. And King has played it in. A chance here for Rue back into the game for Abbey. And what a finish that is by Murdoch. And Abbey are back in business 3 1. And it came from absolutely nothing. Kinane's pass went astray. And Abbey Rangers have wiped out Farnham's clean sheet at the very least. <laughs> it's a cheap goal, though, isn't it? Yeah, he's just scuffed it. He's scuffed the 3 or 4 today. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Uh, well, it always has a touch. It's just been fair to him, yeah. People are due it sometimes, isn't it? Yeah, oh, yeah, it yeah, 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 yeah. And that's a lovely ball now for Smith, who has all the time in the world to pick out across. Tom Smith low, and Tanner's miscontrol presents an opportunity for Little to make it four. Kai Tanner with the assist. I'm not sure how much he knew about it, but a lovely finish from Adam Little, who's deserved his second goal this evening. Never ever looked over his shoulder. Right. Okay, Come here now. Look at that, you're the worst player in this league. Who's that? Who said that? The gaffer? Yeah. Well, I've got to be the worst player in the league. Worst player in the league. Come on, Kai! Oi, get on, Kai. Go on, Chow, go on, Chow, Charlie's on! There you go. Great feet, Charlie. Give him a throw, Chow. Why did you not go for a throw? Go on, Chow. And the referee brings to an end another successful night for Farnham. They have beaten Abbey Rangers by four goals to one. It's 20 wins from 20 and a statement performance from the league leaders. What happened there, mate? You got glue in your, in your shoes or something. Mate, it's just again, meant it. Meant every bit of it. Hey, bring it, bring it, bring it. Oh, it's strange one tonight because I think in first half, yeah, there's some real good points, and after that, I don't think we've got our second gear. Some fucking uncharacteristic mistakes, yeah. Fucking just there was something not just not quite right, yes. Yeah? A few people winning their shells, but it's fucking the first bit was fucking good, yeah. And it's been patchy. It's been good 45, good 45, then a good 45. It's got to be more, 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 yeah. Expect and demand more for each other, yeah. A couple of people went fucking in their shells. No need to be in your shells we're romping the fucking league yeah good come on one play at a time baby one play at a time that was good wasn't it yeah that was 20 good. out of 20 20 out of 20 that brings an end to another week at Farnham Town uh, two games two wins and the unbeaten run still goes on which is the most important thing 
as is being top of the table, I think 11 points clear now. Um, couldn't really ask for much more at the end of January, but we've got some big months coming up. And we've got two more games this week, um, starting tomorrow. We've got Spelfond Sports away, um, that'll be a tough game if it was anything like the uh, home game we had of them uh, two weeks ago. And then we've got a Surrey Cup tie against Kingstonian. Uh, they're a couple of tiers above us, that'll be a great game here down here at the Memorial Ground. So we're looking forward to that one. We'll see you there.